Happy Friday, everyone, and happening now, the creation of State Highway 68, one step closer to becoming a reality in Hidalgo County. The new highway will be built in either Far Alamo or Donna. That's right. CBS 4's Freddie Vela has more on what this means for residents, especially those who could be displaced. Over the past few years, the I-69 and I-2 exchange has seen traffic congestion increase, and TxDOT hopes to relieve some of that with the creation of SH-68, a new north-to-south highway in eastern Hidalgo County. Now TxDOT is holding an open house meeting for residents living between the cities of Edinburgh and Donna, north of I-2, to discuss the future SH-68. We're going to be doing an open house, so that means that people can come in from 2 p.m. to 7 p.m. at any time. We'll take care of them and, uh, and understand what the project is and leave your comment. The rural highway will be created along one road connecting I-2 to I-69 through one of the eastern Hidalgo cities. The idea is to bring relief to an already congested exchange in FAR. It will be a four-lane divided highway spanning a total of 22 miles. We do know one thing, that people care about transportation and people know that they don't want to be stuck in traffic. While many Valley citizens are excited to see the growth, some residents who live within the possible routes have mixed feelings should the project move forward right in their backyard. We'll feel displaced, you know, and what are we going to do? Where are we going to go? Diana Castillo has lived in this home all her life. She's concerned this will be difficult for her family to get up and move. You know, we're thinking this is where we're going to die, you know, this is where we're going to, you know, pass the rest of our, our lives and, you know, and for, for them just to come and decide, I would let, you know, like it if they let the people decide. Luis Nieto, who owns two businesses in Donna, says he understands the need for such a highway. Well, I think it's going to be a good thing having, having four lines of highway coming through here. TxDOT says that they don't know exactly which route SH-68 will be created. Signs says he hopes residents will help make that decision. In Alamo, Freddie Vela, CBS4 News and ValleyCentral.com. All right, thanks, Freddie. And that meeting is scheduled for Tuesday, March 15th from 2 to 7 at the Donna North High School. Residents in Donna, Alamo, and also in far north of I-69 are encouraged to attend, and sessions will be held in English and also in Spanish.